Hey everyone and welcome to today's tutorial. In this video I will show you step by step how to transfer crypto from Coinbase to MetaMask. So without further ado, let's get right into it. The first thing you need to do is to go over to coinbase.com and log in. Once you're logged in, you need to go over to the send slash receive button in the top right. Once you click on it, you'll get this pop up and you need to make sure that you're on send and not on receive. So once you're on send, you'll now need to go ahead and go over to pay with. You'll then need to select the cryptocurrency you want to transfer. In this case, I'll go ahead and search for Ethereum. I don't actually hold any Ethereum, but it's just for the example. So once you have selected the coin you want to transfer, you'll now have to fill in the two. To find this address, you need to go over to MetaMask. So if you're using Google, you need to go over to the Google Chrome extension page. That's right here. And you then need to click on it and click on MetaMask. If you're not logged in already, you need to fill in your password and once you're logged in, I recommend you go over to the top right, click on this icon and then click on expand view. Because by doing so, you'll get MetaMask in full screen. The next thing you need to do is to select the right wallet or chain. In this case, I'll go ahead and search for the Ethereum mainnet. And once you're on the right mainnet or wallet, you can copy your account address. Just go over to your account name and click on it. And you'll then see this message copied. And you can then go over to Coinbase and paste your address in. And by the way, if you're not sure which mainnet or network to use, you can do a quick Google search. I recommend you search something like which network supports and then the name of the currency you want to transfer. And once you have copied the right network, you can now go ahead, paste in your address and then you can choose to add a node. This isn't necessary, so I will go ahead and leave it blank. And by the way, as you can see, my address is indeed an Ethereum address. The next thing, and also the last thing I need to do, is to fill in the amount you would like to transfer. You can fill in this amount in dollars worth, or you can click on this icon with the two arrows in it to fill in an amount of Ethereum you would like to transfer. And once you've entered the right amount, the last and final thing you need to do is to click on continue and you'll then have to fill in your two-factor authentication codes. If you found this video helpful, let me know by leaving a like or subscribing to my channel for more tutorials about cryptocurrencies.